on my dead ex bookie boy the night started off so smooth man mama was inside the front room watching her good times you feel me she even had us some you know saying some of that some of that yeah some of that zada smoke man, you feel me? she was you know what I'm saying chilling in the front room man you feel me me personally i was in the kitchen man trying to get me some grub man trying to get me some noodles man you feel me you know what i'm saying i was watching some tiktok man i forgot to put the uh the seasoning inside the pack man so i was you know what i'm saying i got distracted because of the tiktoks i'm watching the cast in that tiktok man you feel me and really enjoying it and all of a sudden the lights go off i'm like what the fuck put my phone up look around bro i can't even see nothing for real, for real. i can see the ambience and stuff but i can't really see nothing bro i'm kind of blind in this motherfucker i look left to right can't even see i can kind of see my og so i just walk up on her I tell my OG, I don't know what's going on with the lights, but I'm finna go see if everybody lights off on the block. I walk off, go outside to the front door, man, because I gotta go see if our lights is the only people that's out, well, you know what I'm saying? If it's a whole block thing. Listen, gang, I get outside, bro, and I was surprised, bro. I'm like, what the f is going on right now, bro? Everybody lights on, bro. I'm looking at the whole block. I'm, hey, it's all bright in they crib and shit. It's all bright in the building. The street lights on, nigga. There ain't no power outage on the block. So, nigga, why are lights off, nigga? So, I'm looking at the crib. I'm like, nah, you feel me? It's only gonna be two options, man. You feel me? It's only gonna be two options that the reason why the lights off. On my homie, so I walked to the back of the crib to go to that little circuit board thing, you know, to flip the switch on, you feel me? I gotta flip it on and off, man. It ain't even work. So I took my goofy ass right back in the house. There can only be one more reason why the light's off, bro. So I'm chopping it up with OG, bro. Long story short, bro, she ain't even paid a light bill, bro. Like, what, nigga? What you mean you ain't paid a light bill? What's going on? Why you didn't say nothing? If you need help on a light bill, you could have said that. I could have got a job or something. She get mad at me for asking questions, so I just walk up to my room, man. I had to go think about a way how we gonna get these lights on, nigga, about a ma. Now I'm in my room just thinking, like, dang, man. Man, who can I ask for some money? Or what can I sell to get some money? I was finna sell my Xbox. You know when they say your nigga sell his game system, they gotta be down bad. Then I got an idea. I'm like, man, I'm finna hit my crazy cousin Rico, bro. I know he gotta play or something for me, man. They could put me onto some money or something. I text him. I'm like, what you want, cuz oh? He takes back. He say, smoking right now. I hit him back like I need a favor. He say, what you need? I answer. I say, need quick bread. He say, come to the slot. I'm like, on my way. It's go time. Now, cuz I'm finna put me on, bro. You know what I'm saying? I don't even ask cuz for much, so I know he gonna come look out for me. I put on my clothes, man. Hopped on my bike, man, and pedaled straight to his crib. It was a decent little ride, man. He ain't lived too far from me. Knocked on the door four times, man. I'm waiting for somebody to open the door for me. I cut some Rico girlfriend open the door for me, man. I walked straight in and went right to the kitchen, man. He's in that smoking. I say, What up, boy? What you been on? He, what up, cuz, man? I ain't been on shit, man. I've been up in the crib watching TV and shit like that. I look at the table, I'm like, Shit, look like motherfuckers doing way more than uh, watching some TV. He say, Man, you know me, I gotta still make my money on the side. And being the only motherfucker paying bills in this motherfucker, man, I gotta have that money coming in. I say, speaking of bills, man, I had to hit you because, nigga, the light bill was due, nigga. My OG didn't pay it, nigga. You know what I'm saying? She ain't even tell a nigga, you know what I'm saying? Let a nigga know she was struggling, nigga. So, nigga, the lights got cut off at the crib, nigga. I just hit you to see if you got some quick shit for me to do. He say, oh, my baby, boy, I was in your position last shit, boy. My motherfucker OG lights went off, the water wasn't working, nigga. Everything was fucked up, nigga. The rent was due, nigga. We was finna get evicted, nigga. I had to get it out the mud, nigga. You see why I'm at now, nigga? I had to jump off the porch, man. It's a lot of shit I ain't Wish I ain't did, but shit. But a nigga had to do what I had to do, man, to pay them bills. I say, yeah, man, that's why I hit you, cuz of man. I'm already knowing you understand that shit, but what you got on the floor for me, man? Nigga need some quick money for real. He said, I'm finna put you onto this lick. I'm like, oh, bro, nigga, what's the details of the lick, though, cuz oh? He basically started telling me all the details about the lick and shit, man. He finna set these east side niggas up with a female, man, on some back door shit, basically. He said he been watching these niggas on Instagram for a little while, and they got motion. He said the female said they shoot dice every Saturday. The female that he got the back door, these niggas been fucking with one of the niggas for month she said the nigga she messing with and his homies is all arrogant and they think they untouchable cuz i said he likes the motherfuckers that think they untouchable and can't get robbed but i couldn't wait though i'm like nigga come on let's go get these niggas right now Kozo pulled out the phone and started texting the girl that's supposed to be helping him back though these niggas he started texting her and shit i guess he was asking details about what the fuck going on with the niggas right now is they shooting dice or not because we supposed to be sticking up they dice game Kozo like yeah they just started shooting dice 
Cuz will put his phone up. He say, nigga, it's go time. Nigga, niggas finna start shooting dice right now. Nigga, where your blick at? You know, I keep my little six shot on me, man. I up my blick, nigga, put it right in his face, nigga. Yeah. This nigga Rico gonna look at my gun and smile. I'm like, nigga, what you smiling at? Ain't nothing funny. He gonna chuckle and say, boy, you need to get that gun back to wherever you got that motherfucker from. That motherfucker old as hell. Yo, ass nigga, you do some new, new shit, nigga. You tripping. I tell his ass, boy, my dead dog told him I'm not trying to hear nothing, nigga. This motherfucker gonna do the job, nigga. I put the pole up and say, I'm like, boy, since you talking crazy about my pipe, nigga, give me a pipe then, nigga, since you got all the money and shit. Nigga, to myself, I don't get no pipe, but I got my pipe, nigga. Fuck you, mean this nigga. This Glock 17 with a switch, nigga. Stop playing with me, nigga. I switch cheese, nigga. This will really get a nigga off me, nigga. Man, fuck you and your switch, nigga. Come on, nigga. Let's go get this money, nigga. You playing and shit. This nigga laughing as we leave the house and shit, man. I'm like, boy, get your good fast on, boy. That shit not that funny, boy. We going to the kind shit, man. I'm thinking in my head, like, yeah, nigga, this the right time to go stick a nigga up, nigga. Come up on the play. You walking to Cuzzo Car, I'm looking like, damn, nigga, this a new car. He said, yeah, nigga, you like it? I'm like, yeah, nigga. I'm like, what you got on there? And then got 20 folds on that mama. I'm damn, 20 folds on the Caprice? I get in the kind of shit, man. I'm like, damn, it smell good. And this motherfucker nigga got the black ice, nigga, and all that, nigga. He must really just got this car. But whole time in the back of my head, I'm like, nigga, this probably be a striker, nigga. This nigga don't got no license plate on the front or the back. This nigga tweaking. When we pulled off, though, I told his ass, be cool, nigga, on that speed, nigga. Cause your ass don't got no license plate, nigga. It's not trying to get bumped with two pipes in the car. I'd be mad as hell to go to jail with this old ass gun on me. And this nigga might get federal time for having a switch on the Glock, nigga. So he better be cool. But we made it to the east side and shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Shirty dropped low, so he pulled up to the low and shit, man. You feel me? Pulled right up on these niggas' blocks, bro. And parked right up the street from the motherfucking house that we supposed to be going to. I'm looking around the block to make sure nobody watches us. You know what I'm saying? No funny business. Cuz will put the motherfucking whip in park, man. He start giving me the plan and shit, man. He say he finna go around back, and I'm gonna go around the front. That nigga pulled out his phone and showed me a video that the old girl sent them of these niggas shooting dice right now. Look at the footage. Shorty recorded them niggas on the slick tip. They ain't even paying attention, man. I'm like, all right, these niggas sweet, man. Come on, let's get this shit over with. He say, I right, bet, nigga. Give me two minutes, nigga. Be on point. He bop out the whip, man. You feel me? Walk around back with the blick out, nigga. That nigga walking like he been doing this shit, nigga. But me, on the other hand, nigga, when he hopped up the car, nigga, nigga, I started getting anxiety attacks, nigga. What's up, nigga? I was nervous as fuck, nigga. I ain't never hit no lick before, nigga. My heart was beating like a motherfucker, but I couldn't show that to him, nigga. But I pulled out my phone, nigga, to make sure it was two minutes to be exact, nigga. I'm like, oh, yeah, two minutes? Come on, nigga. It's time for me to bop out. I hop out the V, pull the blick right out the Nike tape, nigga. And start walking towards the house. My heart was beating fast and fast as I got closer to the house. Nigga, I look like a rookie, nigga, the way I walked up to the house. I'm looking at the cars and shit. I'm like, yeah, niggas got money, niggas got BMWs chargers out here, nigga. Okay, nigga, this finna be easy late. But I get down behind the BMW truck, man. I'm waiting on my cousin to go ahead and start the little play. He told me to sit in the front just cause the nigga try to run to the front. But I'm looking trying to see if this nigga in position. But I peep his ass in the back, had me behind the wall, man. He peeking, man. He trying to find the right time to pop out. He gave that motherfucker one more good peek, man. Look. And he popped right off that wall, nigga. He's on some task force shit, nigga. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie. That nigga natural at this shit, nigga. He seemed like he always do this. That nigga got the creep into the side of the garage, nigga. He ready to take something down, nigga. I can see the look in his ass. I look at him, man. I'm like, yeah. He looking at me. I'm looking at him, nigga. We both know he ready. So he pop out, nigga. Ugh. He see all my baby back. None of y'all niggas move. Y'all niggas get down right now, nigga. Drop all that cash and all that. Shorty had to play her part, so she had to run off to the front, nigga. I caught her, nigga. Like, yeah, where you going? Go your ass back there. I think she was surprised because she was expecting it to be one nigga the whole time. It was two of us, nigga. But she was calm, man. She played her part, went back to the garage, man, and got down. Me and Cuzzle had these niggas on their knees with their hands up, nigga. That nigga with that tank top on was nervous and scared as hell. I'm like, man, this nigga scared, but him and his homies posting on Instagram with pipes and shit. Rico said, he go a Glock right there for you, nigga. We better take that, nigga. I told this just to put all that shit in the bag, nigga. We took everything them niggas had on them. Them niggas had chains, money, two pipes, nigga, all that, nigga. We took all that shit. Cuzzo even took the key fob to the BMW that was parked up. He put all that shit in the bag right in the truck, nigga, and he was like, hey, Cuzzo, nigga, hey, go ahead and bip off, nigga. Go to the car, nigga. I'm gonna meet you at the spot, nigga. I'm like, nigga, you don't gotta tell me twice, nigga. I took my gun, nigga. I started walking off to the car, nigga. Took a little jog so I could get to the car a little quicker, nigga. Nigga, I get to the car, nigga. I put the key in the ignition, nigga, and I pull straight off, nigga. I did like 80 down that block nigga that little v6 got up because i still got the pipe to their head but he easily walking off nigga trying to itch his way back to the motherfucking bmw so he could take that motherfucker he hop in that bitch nigga got the push start on that motherfucker he cut that motherfucker on put that bitch in reverse pull right out with the door open he ain't even close the door he trying to get up out of there pulled out the driveway huh, put that bitch in sport draw right off took off he was doing that bitch all the way back to the south side
after we hit the link, man, me and Cuzzle met up at the little spot, man. You feel me? We just in the back chopping it up while we wait on old girl to link with us. I said, Cuzzle, that was smooth as hell, nigga. Appreciate you for taking me on that shit, nigga. I needed that. He said, oh, my baby boy, you know I got you, shorty. I said, hell yeah, nigga. This should be more than enough for the light bill and a little something, something on the rent. Cuzzle say, hell yeah, nigga. If you need some more bread, nigga, just hit me up. Nigga, keep going on licks and shit, nigga. I be needing a nigga I trust with me out here, nigga, doing this shit with me. I'm by myself. I say, I'm gonna most definitely hit you up, nigga. That's easy money. He say, oh, my baby boy, just hit me up, boy. You know, I got you my favorite cousin. But we continue to chop it up and shit, man. Shorty finally pulled up after 10 minutes and shit. Shorty pulled up and her little Toyota fishbowl is here. Motherfucker, see all through the whip. She acting like we just ain't hit no lick or something. She pulled up, listen to that pound town by Sexy Red. Pound town. Just left pound town. I'm boy, what? Hey boy, fuck around with her. It's late as hell. And I don't even know if y'all peep, man. Shorty hopped up the car with that wagon, slugging that motherfucker. I'm damn. She say, talk quick, knock slick. Where my money at? Rico look at her like, man, your bread right here, Shorty. She instantly wanted her little stack. She was trying to get her bread and get the fuck on. She say, thank you, and walk right off with the money in hand. Quick as hell. Cuzzle looking at the ass. He like, man, when you gonna let me take you out? Your ass be playing. She told his ass, boy, boom. Whatever the fuck that mean. But she hopped in the car, pimped right off. Started that motherfucker up, man. Hey, she got gone, nigga. I think she had somewhere to be or something. We watched her in that fishbowl while she pulled off, listening to that pound town. But she cut that shit right back up and sped off. Rico turned to me and said, man, I've been trying to fuck with Shorty for a little minute. Man, her ass be playing and shit. Playing hard to get. I ain't finna chase her ass. I say, man, that's probably what she wants you to do, nigga. She wants you to chase her ass for real, for real, nigga. But find out shit, what she like to do and work off that. He said, we don't even talk if we ain't backdooring niggas and getting money together. I say, me personally, nigga, I want to even fuck with her, nigga, if she backdooring niggas with you, nigga. So what's stopping her from backdooring you for some more money? He said, I'm already knowing because it's just that motherfucker thing. And that motherfucker thick as hell, though, nigga. But shit, nigga, come on, nigga. I'm finna drop you off to your crib. I'm like, all right, come on. He said, Lion said that motherfucker ain't thanging, though. But I told his ass, man, you gotta think with your mind, not with your date, nigga. You tweaking. But we hopped back in this VN shit, nigga. We hopped in the whip, nigga. Pulled off, nigga. He left the little BMW truck right there in the back in the cut. He said he gonna come pick that motherfucker up later on tomorrow, nigga. But I ain't gonna lie, man. The lick was kinda easy, man. You know what I'm saying? Nigga might have to jump off the porch for real, man. We was in and out five minutes, man. And I got me a new little pipe, man. Little Glock, man. It's over with. Moral of the story, man. Watch the females that be around you, bro. Some of these hoes be back, though.